I know everybody is talking about canned food month. So people have been asking me for a video on it. So here it is. Let's talk a little bit about February, which is National Canned Food Month. The story of canned food goes back to the waning years of the French Revolution and Napoleon Bonaparte's offer of 12,000 francs to anyone who could develop a method of preserving food for the army. A Frenchman named Nicolas Alpert claimed the prize when he discovered that applying heat to food in sealed glass bottled improved its shelf life. Canning is a really sustainable practice, and that's why I'm talking about it right now, because that's one of our mission. You can reuse the jars and the lids, and when they're not in use, you can even use them as glasses. But it allows you to keep a surplus of food from your garden out of the trash can. And it, you can make simple preserves with gelatin and sugar and use it on toast. You can make spicy watermelon jelly, my personal favorite, got right here. And so these are this is what I'm talking about when I'm talking about canned food. You also have... These ones you can buy at the grocery store, right? So that works too when, you know, if you don't use them in time, they don't go bad and you can always donate them to a good cause. And then the homemade versions, which is great because these are all reusable glass and metal. And so you don't really create any waste and you're saving that, that food from going in the trash can. Learn more about the history of canning and how to preserve your own food. Grandma might be your best teacher. Use hashtag canned food month and post your homemade canned goods on social media.